Hey everyone, my name is Justin, thanks for visiting my channel. In this video series, I want to highlight what I think are some of the most interesting new features and enhancements to ServiceNow in their latest release called San Diego coming this March of 2022. You already saw the thumbnail when you clicked on this video, so let's dive right into some San Diego goodness. In this video, I'm gonna talk about landing pages, or in this specific case, the default admin landing page. Landing pages are something new in the San Diego release with the next experience. They're like a dashboard, but they're not a dashboard. They're a landing page. You'll see one here for the default admin one, but you're also gonna see them in workspaces. That first page you land on is typically called a landing page, and you can manage those um, and administer those. But for this video, I wanted to talk about for the default admin landing page, because as admins, there's certain things that we may need to pay attention to. This is the documentation page for the default admin landing page. I actually didn't see this in my personal developer instance because the default landing page there is set to the App Engine Studio or App Studio, something like that. So it wasn't showing. I didn't see this until on my job we set up a fresh instance. And I was like, oh, that's a cool page. I didn't know that existed. Uh, shout out to Sam Ogden. Uh, he posted on Now Community how to actually get back to this page. I'll put the URL next to me on the screen, but it's slash now slash nav slash UI slash home is the default landing page if you're an administrator when you come in there. What are you going to see? Apps ready to update. I, this is really helpful. I need to, I, going in, pulling up the system applications page is long, tedious, it takes a lot of load. So this is really helpful to get my attention about things that need to be updated. ServiceNow is constantly releasing things, so having a quick call to my attention is great. Apps ready to install, so if these are things I'm licensed for, I'm eligible to install, but are not installed in my instance, so good uh, call out there to bring my attention. And then bringing in some instant security notifications, instant center, security center notifications uh, from that particular dashboard or workspace. There's 39 of them, so hey, get my attention. I, I wanna make sure my instance is secure, so that's really good. Um, my work, what am I working on? Bring all those tasks into one place, so there I can see my assignments, critical tasks, new tasks, approvals above my head there. I've got a graph about the tickets or the tasks that are open by age. This favorites here is actually pulling in my uh, UI favorites, so not all of them. I have a lot more than that, but it's pulling them in here into this little widget, so I have a quick access to those. Any requests that I have um, available or that I need to be working on. And then down below, some informational stuff, some tools, uh, jumping spaceman over a moon and a rocket. Um, I love the visuals in the next experience, they're pretty cool. Um, but just knowledge stuff to get you launched to where you need to go. Again, this is small, not a big deal, but I think for admins, system administrators, having a place where you're gonna see the stuff that's important to you is great and uh, to have our own landing page is awesome. So hope this video was, video was helpful. Uh, we'll see you on the next one. This is just one of many San Diego highlight feature videos I'm gonna make. So if you liked it, please share it with a colleague. If you'd like to support me, please like, subscribe. If there's something you wanna see that I didn't show and you wanna get it on the list of things that we're gonna cover on this channel, drop me a note in the comment. I'll definitely check all those. And other than that, we'll see you on the next video. Thanks for your time.